Hello everyone at Durham Christian Homes. My name is Malia Shahid, and I'm here to ask for your support in the upcoming election to serve as your conservative member of parliament for the town of Whitby. As senior citizens, you've worked hard all your lives, raising children, supporting your family, and helping build and contribute to our wonderful community. Thank you for that. The pandemic had hit us all hard. I hope that you and your family have been able to cope. Although there is still uncertainty, I'm hopeful that the worst of the pandemic is behind us. I'm grateful to our frontline workers and especially healthcare providers who kept us safe and took care of us when we were sick. As a mother of three, I can tell you that I've had some pretty anxious moments too, but I'm grateful that as a family, we've managed to be okay. I am the East Ward Counselor for the town of Whitby. I got into public life because I care about you and my community. And with your help, I will continue to do more for the citizens of Whitby. I know that we all want what's best for our community, for our families, and indeed for our great country, Canada. I'm running to be your federal representative because I believe as a mother, a business person, a community leader, and as a Canadian, that there are fundamental choices before us in this election. The Conservative Party of Canada has a detailed election platform with realistic plans and programs that will get our country thriving and united once again under a new prime minister under Prime Minister Aaron O'Toole. Our platform is precisely what Whitby and Canada needs, following these last very difficult years. Our plan to recover one million jobs lost during COVID will secure jobs for Canadians, including those living in Whitby. We will refuel the economy and stop the out of control spending of the Liberals. We will not mortgage our children and grandchildren's future. As Canada's population ages, we want to ensure that those who wish to stay in their own homes or live with relatives can do so. To support this, we will increase the home accessibility tax credit from $10,000 per household to $10,000 per person. Seniors or their caregivers will also be able to claim medical expense tax credit for home care rather than limiting this credit to only those who live in group homes. A conservative government will also double the Canada's workers' benefit up to a maximum of $2,800 for individuals or $5,000 for families. This benefit will be paid quarterly, directly deposited into your bank account every three months instead of a tax refund at year end. This will help people like you who choose to work past retirement, giving yourself a bit more income. We will also invest $3 billion over the next three years in renovating long-term care homes to improve their quality and increase the number of personal support workers by promoting these careers through immigration programs. These are all the practical initiatives that we will support you, your family, and your community. As we emerge from the pandemic, you can count on me to be a strong voice in Ottawa. We had that under the great Jim Flaherty, who represented Whitby for so long and helped so many. We had that under the former MP Pat Perkins, who also served Whitby with distinction, both as a mayor and a regional councillor. This election is about choices. By choosing me, you can be confident that the promises that are made will be promises that are kept. I would be honoured and grateful to receive your vote, to represent you and the town of Whitby in a government led by Durham's own Erno Two. Thank you so very much for sharing your time with me today. And thank you again for all that you have done and will continue to do in support of your family, your community, and for a better Canada.